beautiful souls thank you for joining me today for this beautiful archangel michael christmas message i do hope you're all well and you're staying focused believing and trusting in that deep inner knowing that unexplainable love that's within you so merry christmas to all of you that are celebrating christmas i thought it'd be very nice to do this message um, from archangel michael because we do need extra support around this time of christmas um, so we really feel things and it's about coming together and being with that loved one. So um, we're very sensitive around this time. So let's see what Archangel Michael would love to share and express to you. What is the Christmas message that Archangel Michael wants to share with you? So I'm going to be using this beautiful deck to get the messages um, from Michael. Thank you so much to all of you for the love and support that you continuously give me. I am so very grateful to each one of you. And if you would like support on your awakening journey, all the information about the services I offer is in the description box down below. So what is it that Archangel Michael wants to share with you, beautiful soul? What is the Christmas message? And Archangel Michael is all about cutting the doubt and the fear out of your life and giving you this protection. Um, when you're open, when you're in your heart space, when you're in tune with yourself, you can feel Archangel's, uh, Michael, sorry, Archangel Michael's presence with me. So let's see. Just coming through. Forgive yourself. You don't, you've done nothing wrong. There you go. Forgiveness. Forgiveness of yourself. Archangel Michael's saying, forgive yourself. You've done nothing wrong. It's time to let go of things that have happened in the past, things that you may have thought that you've done wrong in the past. Be in this present moment. Forgiveness changes everything. And it is a big one, practicing forgiveness. And we don't realise how deep this is. Because we do think that a lot of the time it's about forgiving others. But to be able to forgive others and things that have happened in your life, you have to forgive yourself first. And we do go around in our everyday life holding on to guilt beating ourselves up and putting ourselves under pressure thinking that we're doing everything wrong because we've got this belief that we're not good enough and there may be something that's happened on your journey that you've had to make a decision choosing yourself where it's involved other people and you feel as if you've hurt them let it go and forgive yourself you've done nothing wrong choosing yourself is the right decision that's what you've been called to do to fully your sole purpose that is your mission, is to show up for yourself. And that is helping um, this world. It's help healing this world and humanity as well. So forgiveness, you're being called to forgive this Christmas. And it could be all coming up for you because we have time to, you know, we, we think more over Christmas time. And as I said, it's just a sensitive time. Um, and there may be loved ones that aren't with us anymore that have passed and you know the people that we're wanting to be in our life aren't in our life and we it just brings so much up and we just go over things it's about coming out of the past being in the present moment and letting go of your old self your old beliefs and be in the now because where you are now there is nothing to you know you, you haven't done anything wrong and you haven't done anything wrong anyway it's in the past that, that you've learned by those lessons You've learned so much about yourself. You created this situation and you have the power to change it. Yeah. So whatever situation you are in right now, you have created it and you have to take that responsibility of it and forgive yourself for, for what you've created. And what you've created might be, might, may come across right now in the 3D and the physical that it's a right mess, <laughs> that you're in a mess. But forgive yourself and own um, what you've created don't try and escape it don't try going over you know if I'd done this and you know if I'd said this blah 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 like we do the could of should of that's all lower vibration what you've created and if it's a mess as I said you can get yourself out of this because you are the creator of your life and that is harsh as well because 
it, 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 we have to take that responsibility of, of what is going on in our life. We've created that and what we've created, if it's not very nice and it is uncomfortable, <laughs> um, it, we, we feel, you know, we feel bad. But there's nothing for you to feel bad of. Just know that you are the creator. And if you're creating um, uncomfortable things and awkward situations, you can change it. And it is it is down to you. You created it so you can get yourself out of it. You, you are powerful enough to create a mess. So you are powerful enough to get yourself out of the mess. You are so powerful. Um, so pay attention to your dreams at this time. Yeah. So don't dismiss your dreams, pay attention to your dreams and through your dreams you could be, you know, get, getting this support um, as well. Things could be happening in your dreams that's given you sacred wisdom, information to help you on your journey. Um, and pay attention to the dreams and your desires as well. Don't just go, oh well that's not going to happen to me because of this situation I've created. That's That isn't that's coming from um, lack mentality, all of those lower energies, as I've mentioned. You're trying to you're trying to move away from that. So pay attention to your dreams because your dreams are very powerful and new beginnings and new fresh start. Yeah, you have the choice to step into this new beginning and this new fresh start when you take responsibility and you forgive yourself. You've got to forgive yourself before you can move forwards. To, to, to delete the things um, you think that have gone wrong in your life or the decisions that you've made that you feel that have been wrong, to let go of that, to be who you truly are, not by not going forwards with the old story of who you thought you were because of what you've been told and what was, you know, you've been absorbed and accumulated over the years, actually move forwards being the innocent, unconditional love that you are. <laughs> because there is no judgment from divine. So you shouldn't be judging yourself, putting yourself um, down as well. But you are so powerful to create a whole new um, situation, a whole new life for yourself when you're in your heart space, when you're in tune with who you really are. And when you're actually moving forwards and paying attention to your dreams and your desires, because your desires, your dreams, desire you too. <laughs> That's why you have the desire in the first place. Um, so, and there may be a lot going on with your dreams around this time, so pay attention, take it in, because there's support and guidance coming through with these dreams. And you may be, I know some of you that be watching will be twin flames, and it may be having dreams about your twin flame as well. Um, so, Beautiful messages from Archangel Michael. This new beginning, new fresh start is here right now. And that has come through last time I used that deck in a reading recently. But it's your choice to step into this new beginning, this new fresh start. You could either choose to get caught up in the situation that you've created and feel bad about it and be hard on yourself and beat yourself up about it. Or you can choose to forgive, to move on, and to create a new situation, um, a healthier situation with you being the unconditional love that you are, not being hard on yourself and going for your dreams and desires and paying attention to your dreams and desires and the dreams that you're having at night time. <laughs> so thank you so much for joining me today for this beautiful Archangel Michael Christmas message. I do hope it resonates with you and I hope that it's supported you at this time around this Christmas period. Um, and remember to always stay focused, to believe and trust in that deep inner knowing, that unexplainable love that's within you. And if you haven't subscribed already, don't forget to subscribe, like and share because it really does help my channel grow. That's if you feel connected to me and you understand me. And I'm sending you so much love, my support, my strength and light, and I love you so very much. See ya! Oh, what's your soul saying?